Hey everybody, what is up? It's your girl Re. For a lot of y'all that watch, still watch my shorts, you guys already know who I am. But if you're new to my channel, I'm Sheree. Hey, I've been doing YouTube for a minute, but you know, it's up and down, it's up and down. But I wanted to make this video because I wanted to show you guys the things that I do and the things that I read that help me to get closer to God, help me walk in my faith with the Lord Jesus Christ. I am a Christian. I believe in my Lord and the Savior. And for a while, I was lukewarm. And you know, God does not like lukewarm at all. Um, and I knew what I had to do. Like I was really new better. I knew the word, I knew of God. But I just pretty much had to do better. It's like plain and simple, like not much to it. And I had to start taking everything into action. And I have been doing that. And I just wanted to show you a few things and books that I've been reading and everything just to help me with um, my walk and my journey with Jesus Christ and growing that intimate relationship with him because everyone can do good actions. Everybody can good do deeds good do deeds but at the end of the day that's quite not what's really going to get you into heaven because god wants to know you for you and he wants to build that relationship with you just like any of your friends you know so let's start off by this inspirational study bible and i had this bible for a long time now and my mom had gave it to me when I moved in this apartment and in September will be three years that I have been living here and it wasn't just till I believe the last year like um, winter time that um, I literally started to knock the dust off of it and start opening it up and literally start reading the word so I will show you it's a little um, thicker book so don't be intimidated I think I was intimidated when my mom gave it to me because I'm like, oh, wow, like, you know, you get a book and you're like, dang, I got to read that like word for word, page for page, you know. Um, but this it's just like the Bible is literally here to help you and you can get through it on your own time. I'm not about to sit here and be like, yep, I start from page one and I read to the end. Like it literally just like your Bible. You just open it up to what what you want to read and what like God calls you to read that day, you know. So this is by Max Lacuto, and I feel like this is very old because my mom had two of these. She has one, and I remember her having that, having this book for like ages, like ever since I was like little. So I know this author is kind of, he's not new, obviously, but pretty much it's life lessons from the inspirational word of God. And this, I love this Bible, and it's a um, New King's James Version, okay? And I like this Bible because it breaks it down like from beginning to end more um, in like, I don't want to say like today's time, but it's just so more like understandable. Um, and if you want to start off really getting to know the word, I'd start off with something like this, like a study Bible then go to your actual bible or purchase an actual bible and then go from there so i usually um read this and i start with start with this and i have a regular bible that i read like um night and day um but that's on my neck my nightstand and i usually like keep it there or bring it out to the living room so with this i also apply this new book that i got and um, it's called Jesus, The Way, The Truth, and The Life. And one of my client's daughters gave this to me. And there's a few things that she actually just purchased for me on her own, which she did not have to do. Um, but she is a minister and she's totally like really ministered in my life. And she's like my spiritual mom holding me accountable to my word and to my relationship with God and just helping me along my way just like you know like a pick me up you know um so she gave me this and this is had this has been my all-time favorite out of all these books I'm gonna show you um not to bash any of them obviously but this is like my all-time favorite because um let's be honest life gets crazy and there's time that I really want to be in the word but I just 
don't really have time for like a whole Bible study, you know, to really like get in depth. This has been my best friend. This goes into like so much detail from Jesus from birth to when he's 33, when he is um, crucified and resurrected on the cross. Um, this has like right here, this says um, the areas where Jesus lived and taught. So it shows you a map of where he ministered and where he lived. And then um, here is a table of contents and there's like three, like three like big chapters and all within those chapters, then it gets down to the one, two, three, four, five, you know, and so on and so on. And um, I'm on page, I'm on, um, lesson I guess you would say like 36 and it's page 93 and it's like little paragraphs like little passages and then on the bottom this one doesn't have it oh it does right here right here on the bottom it goes in more detail and it has like three to four questions and the quest the answers are in this passage and it's just super easy for a quick pick me up if you really um, want to get into the word at that moment but you know you just might not have time later to really like do like a deep bible study or to really like get deep into the word this is your best friend i spend about like 15 to 30 minutes i'll do like one two or three depending on them some of them um i have done there was um one that i did uh not too long ago and it was a little bit kind of like lengthy but they're like it's just for like you know like I said, like a pick me up if you don't have that much time, um, but you're still wanting to be obedient and you're still wanting to get that word to fill you for your day and to fuel you for your day, okay? So these go hand in hand. Um, actually at the top of these, for instance, it'll give you, um, it'll give you a scripture. And then, so what I'll usually do is go to that scripture in here and then read like the passage that way before i'm reading this i'm kind of getting a sense of like the background and what's going to be talked about you know um so love this been doing that i usually do that like almost every day um then she also purchased me this enjoy life forever and i can't find the little like this is like the hardback copy but there was like a pamphlet that she gave me that went up to um just three Bible studies and this has all of them. I think this goes up to like 50 something, like 58. Um, and so these are like full on Bible studies. It has like a QR code um, with all the videos that go into that study. And then at the end it has like a summary and a review and like goals to meet for that week. So you can like apply this to your life. And this is called, um, enjoy life forever okay i am actually on beginning bible study four or fin i finished that i'm on bible study five now and um on thursdays i actually have her um at 12 30 so we had came up with a system that i would just come before work on my own time early to have a bible study you know obviously i don't get paid for that but i was willing to wanting to better my relationship with the Lord. And um, she offered to help me do Bible study. So we do that together. And she's just been such a blessing in my life. She, along with that, she had got me this little notebook right here. And it had one of my favorite scriptures in here, which is 2 Timothy 3.16. All scripture is God breathed. And um, I do a lot of like, as you can see, like the Bible study in here. Um, and so this is what this is for. This is mainly like, I actually have <laughs> um, a few other like personal stuff in here, but I do try to mainly use this and this hand in hand. So, you know, these two go together. So I'm kind of like getting a system, you know. Then um, a few months back, or I think it's actually since like mm, October or November, I signed up for this, um, it's called the Encouraging Word online. So if you go to theencouragingword.org, um, you'll say a prayer, commit your life um, to Jesus Christ, um, become saved. And that's what I did. And um, I didn't know that they were gonna send me stuff. So they sent me these, they sent me this book. It's called God's Strategy for Successful Living. 
Um, and then they sent me two of the daily encouraging words and these are like also so fun if you're really trying to get a pick me up and to get to know God's word but you're in like a short amount of time. This is literally um, like each one you can do a day or you can do a whole page at you know like one time but it's just like a paragraph and they're very uplifting and advice giving too so these love these go hand in hand and then back on this one this is by um who is this by oh don wilton i think i don't think that's the name hold on hold on let me see because it's like two different names so i'm not quite sure like the author right now Oh, it's Don Wilton. Pretty much the this passage right here, it's by Rob Wilton. And it says, yes, my dad has unleashed God's undefeated wisdom in this book. These principles have carried me through life's battles and they will for you too. And same type of thing. They're usually like a, a paragraph or so. And you can just, just get filled with the word, you know. Um, and I like to just read these like hand in hand if I'm really trying to get into the word but I'm short on time or if I feel like I really can't give all my focus which everybody wants to give all their focus to the Lord when they're doing in the word period at all times you know um, but sometimes we get caught up but you still want to apply that um, these gonna be your best friend so if you want daily encouraging words you can go to the website on the bottom it's called the encouraging word.org and um sign up and then they'll send you these booklets um i haven't received anything else but these are um it'll tell you like this has december january february and then this one has um march april may so i'm sure you can like get them for like all year and then last but not least i have just this little handy notebook and this goes more into like my personal life there is some like scriptures and um a few little bible study notes that um, i have in here but i usually try to use this for personal use like what happens to me on a daily my feelings daily and then also every sunday when i go to church i'll bring this and write down the scriptures that you know are on the screen so literally with like all these hand in hand like have been so beneficial to my life and it's just good to have little like bible study things to just like help you with your walk with christ you know but i just wanted to show you guys um the things that have been helping me with my walk in christ and i hope that this video encourages you i'm sorry it's a little bit lengthy this is going to be unedited uncut um sorry it's a little bit lengthy but I just want to let you guys know that these things have been helping me and I hope that they can help you to um, purchase a Bible. I know you can get one on Amazon if you have um, a Christian store in your city, you know, you can go there and purchase one. Or I know there's a lot of like Bible stuff on the TikTok shop that I'm seeing that you can journal in and write in. But I, the point of this video is just to get something that you can spend more time with God and that's also fun for you. That's why I like the Jesus, the way, the truth, the life. This is fun for me because I get to use my pretty highlighters and I get to learn more about God's son from infant to like 33, you know? So these have just definitely been helping me and just get to a space where you can Spend time with your Heavenly Father and gain that relationship because, yes, it's so good to be a good person. Like, continue to be that good person. Continue to do good deeds, to witness to people, to spread God's word. But God wants a relationship with you. When you have your last day and you your soul goes up, you know, God's going to judge you. And he's either going to say one or two things and it's going to be, depart from me. I never knew you or well done my good and faithful servant and you're going to want to hear that second part because if he says depart from me i never knew you that's basically saying 
we don't have a relationship. You've never took the time to sit down and talk to me and study with me and be in my word. And that is just one key thing to gain access into the kingdom. So if you guys have um, any questions, leave them down below. My comment section will be open. And um, I just hope that, you know, your walk with Christ is um, beneficial to your life because it really is. And I just pray that all my brothers and sisters in Christ um, have a good day and just take time out of your day to talk to him and sit in prayer with him and just just gain a relationship you know he wants to know all your little details mind you god already knows all of that but he wants you to come to him and to tell him that's how you have that relationship and that's how you gain access into the kingdom of heaven so thank you guys for watching this video i have all my social media linked down below um and if you have any comments any questions leave them in the comment section and i wanted to do a video of um personal stuff like you know me getting back on youtube and all that but i thought that this video was more beneficial um and just spreading god's word so thank you guys for watching bye